Hey, what is up, Cosmic Gang? <laughs> and um, this is your daily vibes. My apologies for yesterday. I was very, very busy. I had a lot of clients. Um, so I wasn't able to do my video. But today, I don't have uh, anyone else to the afternoon. So I can do it. All right. So for our daily vibes, right? The first card that I pulled was the Five of Wands. And when I pulled this card, I thought it was really interesting. I was like an interesting energy. So the channels that I got was that people are going to be very sensitive right now and willing to passionately defend their ideas. And for you to sort of, you're sort of going to want to stay out of the mix and just allow others to passionately express themselves. Um, take time to listen, avoid arguments or conflict with different kinds of people. And like I said, everyone here has a different outfit on, right? So they're all different kinds of people, different ideas, different concepts, and then they're all fighting one another, but like, why? There doesn't need to be a fight, per se, but this energy is pretty prominent at this time. So then we also have whoa, two of pentacles right here, upright, and how I really perceived this energy was balancing ideas and action. So you might start getting like new ideas, new things you want to do, a new business, new whatever. And it's sort of like, should I move on it? Should I not? It might even be like a new hobby or um, just something that you want to get into. And you're sort of balancing your ideas with your action uh, at this time. So it's not really knowing what the next step is. And it's some minor confusion, but it's nothing really major or detrimental to you. So in order to rectify some of these very strong masculine energies, uh, and even bottom of the deck was King of Pentacles. So we do have some very strong, very Mars-like masculine energies for the day. And um, we have the Queen of Cups. So Spirit is really asking us to feel serene, relaxed in our emotions. And because um, that's really, we really have the gift right now of being emotionally balanced, nonchalant. Um, this is more of a, obviously, a feminine energy being the Queen of Cups. You might want to just have a glass of wine, do some painting. You may want to do some drawing today. I mean, you might want to go into nature. Like, you're really going to want to just indulge in more of your feminine side. Whatever you're really passionate about creatively, even if you think you can't draw, sitting down and drawing sitting down and just um, listening to music, just really, really getting into that vibe is going to be beneficial for your own emotional health. And also, since you want to stay out of all these arguments that are going on, right, you want to stay out of that, um, you're really going to want to, uh, in order to rectify that, you're going to want to get into like your more creative energy. And that's also going to also, for some people, I just got a channel, um, it's going to help your energy move. Like some people have been having maybe some creative blocks, uh, maybe some blocks on some ideas or what they want to do. And if you're overthinking things a little bit, like you know your energy, you know when you're overthinking things, just getting away from that and doing something creative is really going to be beautiful at this time. So this is a fun energy and I feel like this is going to come up in the next few days, especially with the 4th of July right around the corners. We have Ace of Wands energy and uh, I love this energy because... This is the gift, um, how I read this card, the channels that I got for this card is this is the gift of inspired passions. So Friday, Saturday is going to be a great day for aligning with others, um, passionately connecting. You may even find yourself having really enlightening and engaging conversations and really having the uh, satisfaction. You know, when you have a really great conversation with a group of friends, um, it's just like the energy, you know, it's going up and up and higher and higher. And everyone's expressing their self, their ideas passionately. So that's really going to be something that's prominent. This is going to come up, I feel, in the next couple days, though. So on the back end, and this might stay for a little while, especially with all this Saturn energy this month, we have the King of Pentacles. So when I saw this King of Pentacles, I'm like, Ugh, myself because I'm like oh this and I'm really into structure but this feels like a very very heavy energy right now and I usually love my king of pentacles but this energy is like not messing around with you and I feel like this is something that's going to require discipline and longevity it is a supportive energy so it's creating or becoming more stable 
Um, you might get some new business ideas, a promotion, your living situation could change. Um, this is structure coming in to support you. And it's funny because this month of July, this energy is going to be very prominent. Uh, this feels like an energy that's going to be around for a while. Exactly. So, so the Saturn energy, this King of Pentacles is asking for you to create structure, discipline, and routine in your life. And it's asking for longevity. So it really wants you to be consistent with whatever it is that you're choosing to do right now. Um, so that's our daily vibes. I will, um, see you guys tomorrow. Peace.